Oh, wow. All right, so we started game one. Oh, man. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, so we're going ahead and starting off in Smashville. Diddy Kong versus Colrin. Um, it is a very a very dynamic matchup um, because Colrin has the tools to kind of work around and sort of move comfortably around um, his aerials. And Diddy's um, pressure setups. Yeah. Corrin can edge guard really well, and obviously that's a really good way to beat Diddy. Um, kind of work around with him. Oh! Wow! That was so good! Calling out the air dodge, got the neutral B, killed him at a, as early as 70%, I believe. Back to it. Up throw. Up throw. That's damage. I mean, I, 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 I see it. I see it. Went for the more damage or over space control. Ah, missed time to grab. Ooh, okay, damage. I wonder if that's a result of Corrin having a different animation on normal get up. I don't think that's the case. It might have just been a, a miscalculation on the you know, post Yeah, I didn't get the trump. And the pin. Yeah. Pichu's very, plays very carefully. That's good. Yeah, yo, Screamo Pichu's impressing me right now. Like, he's, he's doing real well. I like his play. I like his really patient play. Kind of um, dealing with the banana play really well. He's catching well. his landings really well. Yeah. Good call out. He, he saw him jumping and he's like, all right, try, bet. Like, you're not going to do it again. Like, what's the Trump? I'm surprised he didn't do anything yeah. until the Trump happens. Went right for the ahead. down throw, which I like because the up throw wasn't going to kill yet. So, went for the damage. You know? I would have went for down air there. Tommy would have went for down air there. Down air, yeah, yeah that, that's, that's a Tommy move right it. there. Yeah. <laughs> He has the lead, dude. Why not? Of course, don't, don't sleep on Coastal. Oh, got the air dodge, but he's more, more than capable of bringing back. Dead. Right? Yep. Yeah, I, I thought he was going to live. Um, I think with the right DI, he might have. Yeah. Maybe not. Maybe. It was just probably at, just at that percent. Yeah. Dude, I am loving Screamo Peach's play right now. Yeah, like, it's really good. Like, it's really patient. It's very reactive. And he's good at calling out the short hops off of Diddy, as you saw, like in the ledge. Yeah, like, he keeps pitting him. He's like, yeah. he's like bet. Like, <laughs> if you're going to jump again, bet. <laughs> like, yeah. Let's see if um, Kosong can kind of adjust. And, um, I guess he decided that it's not the problem with the stage. And I agree, it definitely wasn't the stage. You know, he was um, just getting outplayed in a few instances that just really costing him the game. <laughs> the empty hops, I like it, I like it. Call him out again, going after him. Oh, try to catch him. Try to catch him. Yeah. Saw the banana. Hey, put, like, that down, right, put that down, Put that down. Oh, wow. That was a very lucky grab. <laughs> yeah. One thing I know is like when I have like banana, like, I try to pull it towards the ditty. I always do an aerial to catch it and like put pressure. Yeah, yeah. That's the only one I told Adam. Just put it like near me. So it's just my banana. You have to come and get it something. Okay, proper one's right there, but Kyle, Cole saw you notice that. Yeah, he was gonna jump, yeah. Got the power shield, didn't react fast enough, unfortunately. Oh! oh, don't pull out banana like that. That's how you get punished, bro. He yeah. is really good. The banana at combusted. <laughs> like, once he see Diddy, like, pulling out the banana, he's like, bop, hits him with a pin real quick. Yeah, there's cooldown. A noticeable cooldown, like, getting him with a banana. Yeah. Oh, i to catch him with that. Oh. Playing it safe, playing it safe. Around. That's gonna be uh wow. That's okay, it. I didn't rest park. I don't know why, but um, a kill confirmed nonetheless. You know, and I like that. He um he got, he went for the down tilt. He knew that if he would have gone for something, it so wouldn't have been a true combo. So he just like anticipated the defensive the option. Banana. But hit his shield. Oh, that was so good. You know, Screamo Pichu really knows this matchup. Yeah, it, it's showing. It's really showing how much he's played this matchup or how familiar he is with it. Almost died. Yeah. Oh, I thought that was going to be the carry combo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Down to a forward smash. Good spot, guys. 
was able to react accordingly from out of shield with the back arrow. It was really good. Realizing that he missed space down there. I mean, the down there. Oh! Realizing that it was a semi punishable situation. Dude. Yeah. Usually, Corrin's go for a defensive option when they're put in a semi punishable situation such as that one, but went for another aggressive option. I like it. I like it. Oh, there it is! Oh, man, not yet. Uh, we have the crowd going hype for our boy Coastlaw. Tournament stock, or not tournament stock. He trolls, man. Oh, banana. no! Oh, no! <laughs> that was so scary. The banana saved his life right there. Oh, that's it. That's it. Yep. Good stuff. This is such a good game. Yes, it is, man. You can see both of the pre like the pressure on both ends of the players just intensifying a lot. This is not... <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I did not think Screamo Peach was going to do that well. Like, he's <laughs> doing godlike. He's doing very well, man. I'm not, I guess I have to pay more attention to how Jax is doing, because this is a really good showing from Screamo Peach. In fact, I think the seating he was getting is a bit criminal. <laughs> with how well he's doing. I respect it. Backed off from the down tilt. And here comes Coleslaw. Went for the confirm. Getting a certain stage control. Went for the forward there. You know, that fair is kind of stuffing him out a lot. He needs to see how he's going to act different. Kind of adjust to that. Pins are getting less effective, man. I wonder if it's a micro spacing that's being taken into account on Coleslaw or he's just miss spacing it to begin with. The crowd is getting real hyped. This is a really good match going on right now. Oh, Jax versus Gainsbo, clearly. Oh, oh my dear god. That. And you know, and I like it. Because I understand the high recovery from a banana situation like that. Like, you you assume that your opponent is going to go for the low recovery hit. But he went for the high recovery. Coleslaw being one step ahead and just stepping back and covering the high landing. So I understand the high recovery. So it was really good. Um, not, uh, call, call this guy's out. been in the air forever. Going for trumps. Yeah. And I mean, he, he, he got what he needed. He got what he needed. Got the trump, called out the jump. Oh, oh yikes. That was. All punish. Yeah, that was really important Not for the catch. <laughs> that was so weird. <laughs> good, good, good coverage on the normal getup. That's huge, though. Yeah. Don't sleep on the size. Um, one grab from Corrin, and he's dead. So let's see if he was able to confirm it. Ah, he, he went for the rollback on um, Reed, but um, it was just a normal get-up or get-up attack. Went for the confirm. Stayed in shield. You know, and I like it, though. I, I really like it, because I, I, I thought Coastal was going to pick up the banana. Not yet. Right, Coastal's taking control of this game. Oh, that was so good. Yeah, that's that for sure. Most yep. definitely. Um, this is looking good for Screamo. He can definitely bring this up. I mean, we saw what he was able to do on that other stock, um, comboing with his nares. Oh, Kyle's catching a lot of these rolls, man. Yeah, it's looking real scary. That might be that. Yeah, that's a carry combo right there. Yep. Ooh, real that's good enough. showing. I that was such a good game. I like it. I, I, it, it definitely shows that Screamo Pichu is very familiar with the matchup, giving yeah. our, one of our most seasoned players here in Gainesville a really tough a really tough fight. You know, like I said, I think the seeding they might have given him was criminal from how well he did against Coastal. That was really good. Might be, dude. Yeah.